Hello, Junior 2. Today, we will gonna take the even and odd numbers. What is the meaning and the difference between even and odd number? Even number means when we draw the dots of the number and circle each two couple of dots, will not remain for us any dot. And odd number means when we draw the dots of the number and circle each two couple of dots, will remain for us only one dot. Oh, what the meaning of these words? Okay, let's simplify it. Here we have number five. Let's draw five dots. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, then let's circle each two couple of dots. Here the first circle, the second circle, and here we have one dot left for us. One dot, only one dot, okay? So, it's odd number. So, it's odd number. Another one. Here we have number six. Let's draw six dots. One, two, three, four, five, six. Then, let's circle each two couple of dots. First circle, second one, third one. Is there any dot left for us? No. So, it's even number. Another one. Here we have number eight. Let's draw eight dots. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's circle each two couple of dots. First circle, second one. Third, fourth. Is there any dot left for us? No. So it's even number. Another one. Here we have number three. Let's draw our dots. Here's three dots. One, two, three. Let's make our circles. Here, first circle. Okay. Uh, is there any dot uh, left for us? Yes, there is one dot left. So, it's odd number. It's odd number. Okay, next one. Here we have number zero and number one. If number zero uh, is number zero, Odd or even number? Number zero is an even number, okay? Number zero is an even number. And number one, also even, uh, no, number one is odd number, okay? Number one is an odd number. Why number one is an odd number? Because number one has only one dot, okay? And we, we should circle two dots. So number one is odd number. And number zero is even number. Okay, here. We have 32 and 47. We want to know if these two numbers, even or odd. If we have a number of two digits, and we want to know if this, num if this number, even or odd, uh, okay, here, for here we have 32, number 32, okay? We will not draw 32 dots, we have no time. What we will do is looking at the ones place. Here we have tens and ones. Looking at the number, at the ones place. Which is number two. And we will see if this number odd. So number 32 is an odd number. And if this number even. So 
32 is an even number so we know the number is even or odd by the number at once place here we have number two in once place so let's draw our dots one two okay let's make our circle okay is there any dot left for us no so number 32 is an even number okay number 47 47 here tens and ones look at the number at once place which is number seven okay let's make our dots one two three four five six seven okay our circles one two three okay is there any dot left for us yes okay there is one dot so uh, number 47 is an odd number okay next one okay here we have number 156 and 191 we have three digit numbers uh, we have three digits we have three digits okay in number 156 is it even or odd what uh, we see it we look at the number at once please okay we look we look at number uh, at the number at once please here we have number six let's make our dots one two three four five six and our circle one two three is there any dot left for us no so number 156 is even number it's even number okay here 191 look at number uh, uh, in the once place which is number one okay number one is an even or odd number we know that number one is odd number so 191 is an odd number here properties of e uh, of even and odd numbers if we have even number plus or minus even number equal even number will give us even number if we have odd number plus or minus even number the answer will be odd number if we have odd number plus or minus odd number the number will be the the result will be even number here we have first number one we have 6 plus 4 equal 10. 6 as is uh, uh, even number because if we draw our dots and make our circles will not remain for us any dot. So 6 is uh, even number and number 4 is also even number. So number 10 is even number. Okay even number plus even number will give us even number okay second one number four plus number one number four is even number okay number one number one uh, is odd uh, number we know that number one odd number so even number plus odd number will give us odd number so number five is odd number 3 plus 3 equal 6. Here, number 3 is an odd number. Because if we draw our dots and make our circles, we circle uh, only two dots, okay? We put in circle only two dots. So, will remain for us one dot. So, number 3 is odd number. So, 3 plus 3 equals 6. Number 6 is an even number. Because odd number plus odd number equal even number. Here, 
Number one, four minus two equal to four is an even number. Minus two, two is also even number. Equal to two is all is even number. Okay, uh, even number minus even number equal even number. Second one, odd number minus even number equal odd number. Here we have number seven. Number seven is an odd number. Minus number four equal three. Number four is even number. Number three is odd number. Number three here. Five minus three equal two. Odd number minus odd number equal even number. Five is odd number. Three is odd number equal two. Two is even number. Here, in this question, use the following numbers to make equations. Its result is even. He wants from us to add or subtract two numbers, which their result should be even number. Okay? In properties, we know that even plus or minus even equal even number. Odd number plus or minus odd number equal even number. Okay? Here. I will choose uh, the first one. I will choose number 13. Okay? I will choose number 13. 13 is an even or odd number. 13 is odd number. Look at the once place. Number at the once place. It's a 3. And we know that 3 is odd number. Because if we draw our dots and circle uh, 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 two couple of dots, will remain for us one dot. So 13 is an uh, odd number. Plus what will give us even number? We know that odd number plus odd number will give us even number. So, we should search for odd number. Okay. Here we have number 10. Number 10, odd or even number? Number 10, look at the number at once, please, which is 0. Okay, 0, we know that 0 is an even number. So, we will uh, not take it. Okay, number 60. Number 60 is also even number because here number in one place is 0. And 0 is even number. Okay. Here we have 54. 54 is even number. Here number 4 is an even number. Okay, here number 11. Number 11, even or odd number. Number 11 odd number because number in one place is number one and we know that number one is an odd number so i will choose number 11 13 plus 11 13 plus 11 equal what three plus one equal four and one plus one equal two 24 24 13 plus 11 equal 24. And 24 is an even number. Because here, if you look at the number uh, at once a place, uh, it's 4. And number 4 is an even number. Okay. Number 2. Okay, I will choose for number 2, number 60. Okay. Number 60. Number 60, even or odd number? Yes, it's even number. Uh, okay, so the number in uh, here should be even. To give us even number. Okay, here, number 10. Even or odd number? Number 10, even number. So I can take it. Okay, to give us... To give, uh, to give us even number. 60 minus 10 equal what? 60 minus 10. 0 minus 0 equal 0. 6 minus 1 equal 50. 
5 6 minus 5 equal 5 so the result is 50 and 50 is an even number look at the number at once place which is 0 and we know that 0 is even number ok junior 2 we have finished for today I hope you understood very well. Thank you.